Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome to Path to Wellness. Today's video is a mushroom and green pea risotto. So if you're not yet subscribed to the channel, go ahead and click the subscribe button and check the bell so you're notified of my new videos. And I do appreciate that. So I actually made this recipe from the Forks Over Knives book and it was really good. So I thought I would make a video about it. It's whole food plant-based, of course. It's oil-free, sugar-free, gluten-free, and has the option of being salt-free. I did add some sea salt in my recipe, but of course you can keep that out if you want. And it's really tasty, so go ahead and check it out. Let me know in the comment section what you think about it. And real quick before I show you, I wanna mention I'm doing fat loss and wellness coaching now. So if you'd like some extra help on your path to wellness, go ahead and email me or you can message me through Instagram or Facebook, and those links are in the description box below the video. And I'll have the ingredients and the directions in the description box as well. All right, so check it out, let me know what you think, and here it is. All right, so here are the ingredients you're gonna need for the recipe. It's gonna be two cloves of garlic, cup of frozen peas, an onion, eight ounces of mushrooms, a cup of rice, a quarter cup of cashews, and you want to soak those in a cup of water, six cups of vegetable broth, a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar, a teaspoon of dried thyme, a tablespoon of nutritional yeast, and I used some sea salt, that's optional, and some pepper. So that's everything you're going to need. It's pretty simple. And the first thing you're going to do is you're going to chop up the onion and cook that for about five minutes over high heat with a little bit of water in there. Also, you want to get a large saucepan and combine the vegetable broth, the rice, the garlic, and the thyme, and you bring that to a boil over high heat, reduce the heat to medium, and you cover it and simmer until the rice is cooked, which is going to take you about 45 minutes. So get all that going. Once it's boiling, cover it up, simmer for 45 minutes. Once the onions are gone for about five minutes, you stir in the mushrooms and the pepper, and you cook that over medium heat uncovered, you stir it up uh, for about eight to 10 minutes until the mushrooms are nice and tender. Meanwhile, you wanna go ahead and transfer the cashews and the water that they're soaking in into a blender and you blend that up until smooth and then you can just set that aside. Next, you wanna add the green peas to the mushroom and onion mixture and you want that to cook for about five minutes. You can always add some water if you need it so it doesn't stick. So just continually stir that and kind of cook that up for a few minutes. So you got the mushroom, onion, and pea mixture in one pot, and you have the rice, veggie broth, and all that in the other pot, and that's still cooking. Once the rice is done, you want to add the cashew milk along with the mushroom, mushroom mixture, and the nutritional yeast, and the apple cider vinegar. Stir that all up, and you want to cook that for about 30 minutes. You can always add more liquid if you need to, but I didn't need to. And then lastly, you wanna let it sit with the lid on for about five minutes, just so it thickens up and gets you that risotto texture. So there it is. Enjoyed that with a smoothie and some green beans and an avocado. Thanks for watching everyone. Give a thumbs up if you liked the video and we'll be back soon. Bye-bye.